Hey ELC family, Pastor Jerry here and just actually making a video just to give you guys a heads up on what's going on. I guess we can call this the state of the ELC union. Uh, pretty much what's going on in the church right now, we're entering, uh, we're actually, we're, we're leaving our first quarter of the year of 2021, the year after the pandemic. And um, everything is going really, really well at Empowered Life Church. Um, we know that a lot of you guys are in church, a lot of you guys are out of church, and either way, it's okay. We just want you to stay connected to church, and you can do that either online or in person. And um, and both of you, um, the in the the online and the in church families are equally as important to my wife and I and to the ministry. Uh, we're going to be coming up with a lot of new creative ministries that you can do online and also if you hear in person and as you transition from online to in person you can jump right in and uh, it'll be just like walking up the stairs so it'd be great um, we have a lot going on with our kids program we have some transitions happening we have some a lot of enhancements happening and i'll share more with you about that later on and we're excited about that um, we're excited about uh, doing more things uh, as far as outreach, as far as in our community, that's going to be happening. And so I also don't want to forget all the people who watch us online. Uh, gosh, on Facebook, on Instagram, on YouTube. Uh, I didn't realize how big of a reach we had uh, as a church of 250, 300 people. I'm, I'm blown away at that. And so um, it blesses my heart, it blesses my wife, and it, it lets us know that we are really in the center of God's will. When I look out and see all the views, when I look out and see all the testimonies and the comments of our church family that is um, not even here. Uh, they've, they, they've never been in our building or they haven't been in our building in years. Uh, and so that blesses our hearts. Also, thank you so much for those of y'all who stay connected, not only through watching, not only through attending, um, not, not only through serving, but also stay connected through your offerings and your tithes. Keep those coming. We have so many plans this year. We, we want to give more to our, uh, our Mexico ministries, our Pakistan ministries, our Belize. We have ministries all over the world now. We have at least 11 to 12 ministries that we're supporting, that you, are, are, that you all are supporting, our church family, day in and day out. And um, we hear so many thank yous from the pastors that are in the bush, that are in city, that are on islands, that are um, even, even we, we even have one person that their ministry is so crucial and so dangerous that I can't even, I don't even know where they are. I just know where, I, I know the area of the country that they're in. And so thank you so much, ELC family. Once again, thank you for your tithes and your offerings. Keep those coming. They help us maintain normalcy they help us keep the building going keep the lights on pay the staff take care of my wife and i um, our children um, they help us pay all the utilities so thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you and uh, don't ever think that we take those for granted so i just wanted to again say thank you um, and uh, again we have so much going on right now with gosh with summer coming up with graduation coming up with um, our men's conference coming up um, with online, we're going to be expanding our, our, our online services here uh, this fall and into next year. We're already planning for next year. We're still believing God for, for, uh, for new facilities here soon. Um, we're still believing God that uh, everyone continually sows into our first fruits. Um, that's still going on, that, and that never really stops. And so I, I just can't tell you how much my wife and I appreciate all of you all for being a part of the Empowered Life Church family. Uh, if you're new here, uh, and even if you've been here for a while, you may not know that our core values are faith, family, fun, and fellowship. If those four things aren't happening at the same time or any particular order, you're not at Empower Life Church. And then our mission here is to empower people and transform lives. And so we're doing that in 2021. We're going to do it more. And uh, I'm just excited. So anyway, just want to give you guys this quick video to say thank you, thank you, thank you from my wife and I, Pastor Tony. And just say that 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 we love you, um, we appreciate you. Uh, nothing you do is taken for granted. And uh, our church staff, and as a matter of fact, speaking of that, we now have, let's see, one, two, we have, let's see, we have Pastor Bruce, who's our new church administrator. We have Pastor Blaine, who's healing 
from his knee surgery. We have uh, pastors Pat and Pam Miller. Um, they're here now. Thank you, full time. Um, we have our ministers, Minister Joe Kirsch, Minister uh, Debbie Reynolds. Uh, we have all of these people here at the church who are ready, willing, and able to help you along the way. And even if my wife and I can't be there like we used to be years ago, uh, God has brought these people to our church to be a, an extension of my wife and I, to be an extension of the gospel. So, um, and, and so we're just thankful again. So anyway, I'm done talking. Go have a great Wednesday. We love you all so much. And uh, we're here for you all. Um, my wife and I are here for you all, and so are the pastors and the ministers. All right, go and have a great Wednesday. We'll see you guys either online or in person Sunday morning. And uh, we're excited. So God bless you guys. Love y'all. And we'll see y'all soon. Bye-bye.